I'm sorry that intro was so dramatic. I it, literally the three five seconds it, it really counts. So I need to get the viewers' attention. Um, my house is a mess. I I figured we we clean up because as you can see my table is a mess. So that's what we're gonna do. What's up guys? We just got off of work. I can finally take this off. I go to Osaka very soon, so that's very nice. Um, uh, I just need my cat, man. Just need my cat. What is going on, guys? We're going somewhere special today. Sorry, I'm talking a little quiet because I'm in the airport, but um, I'll show you guys the flight where exactly I'm going today. But I'm really excited since it's my first time coming here. Um, I haven't explored much of I haven't explored much of Japan since I've gotten here, so we're going somewhere really cool. So I'll see you guys on the plane. Shit. We're right there, guys. You're right. Hi, right, guys. We made it to Osaka Station. We made it to the Osaka Airport, um, and. It's a little hard navigating while carrying a camera, so I'm just gonna bring you guys to the hotel, um, and then I'll see you guys when we're all packed up and at the hotel, okay? They're bloody looking at me. I'm trying to vlog for the camera. This guys. is this is our uh, hotel room. <laughs> yep. I thought she was playing with the safe, but apparently that's the AC. So, uh, Osaka's airport. Oh, the bitch. <laughs> okay, we're in Osaka. <laughs> We are in Osaka. Alright guys, we're on the way to meet my friend, but after that, I'll see you guys in the main part of Osaka. Um, and yeah. Okay. This is Osaka. Sort of. So, we'll see you guys back in Kakashima. Okay, welcome back, guys. So, you're probably wondering why I'm dressed up in this. Actually, I have a work meeting soon. 
And if you don't know, I guess like my company does like the evaluation scores of how I'm doing at my schools. And apparently I'm not talking to kids enough, which all you can do at the job is talk to the students. So they're having a talk with me about my scores. Honestly, I'm trying to leave anyway. I'm trying to quit this job. I'm trying to, I'm, I've been trying to leave for the longest time. Um, so I, I'm kind of just waiting to put my two weeks in. I'm kind of waiting to get a new job. And then we're out of here. So regardless of what happens or what's going on right now, I don't know, it doesn't really matter. But anyways, that's why I'm, I don't know, I'm back. Um, I have to wear this for like the meeting. It's just like a one-on-one -on -one meeting. Nothing too serious. But um, yeah, I, I don't know. I'll show you guys the day in my life and what I've been up to. I think I might re start recording on like my iPhone for like, I don't know. Just because my camera is really big. So if, here, I'll, I'll do uh, something real quick. So this is what it looks like. So basically if I'm recording on my iPhone, we can pretty much get the footage that we need. Um, and then, yeah. So yeah, anyways, that's kind of what's going on right now. I'm hoping that I'm leaving this like prefecture by the summer I there's no evidence like to support like how it's like a gut feeling I just feel like I'm leaving soon um and so yeah I don't know uh, I'll let you guys know in the next couple of vlogs what's going on with my life but as of right now we're trying to escape Kagoshima um and go to Tokyo and bring Lauren with us so lots of stuff is happening um all we can really do is just let time pass it and and do its thing and i'll see you guys after the work meeting i think yeah i'll see you guys after the work meeting okay so the next day guys we got off with the work meeting yesterday basically they said they're not renewing my contract so i don't have a job after august um, I don't know. I Like I said, I've been, like, trying to manifest stuff, right? And, uh, this might be just parts of the Bridge of Incidents. But, I don't know, for some reason, I don't feel it in my heart that I'm going back home. I don't know, that doesn't make any sense. Like, basically, I got fired from my job yesterday. Um, they said they'll keep in touch with me. They ha I might have, like, a couple months. Um, but, uh... And I'll show you guys of a, uh, a little video I took around June 1st of me packing my suitcase. And this sounds absolutely crazy, but I just feel like something big is coming for me. Hold on, man. It's June 20th. Uh, I stopped feeling restless. I don't know. Sometimes I really get that. Uh, I packed my suitcase over there because I'm trying to live in the end. I'm like, I'm ready, universe. I'm ready to go. We're leaving by August. Uh, and it's scary and I had huge huge anxiety like up to my stomach just like really breathing like what am I gonna do what am I gonna do what am I gonna do um, I haven't told any of my family yet which uh, I, I, I haven't only told like my girlfriend and um, my, my best friend um, next door <clears throat> so I guess what I'm trying to say is um, regardless of what happens um, I just feel like everything is working out in my favor I can't see it just yet. It's currently like, it's July 24th. So if a job offer is happening soon, it needs to be in August. It needs to be soon. It needs to be, it needs to be soon. Um, so I know where to go and so I know what to do. And um, yeah, all I can say is just wish me luck. Wish me luck, guys, because I'm going to need it. Um, I'm going to start packing pretty soon. Just start packing everything. That way I'm like, I'm ready to go. Because honestly, I'm ready to go soon. I realistically want to leave in like two weeks. Um, one way flight to Tokyo doesn't cost that much. So, I'm a little scared. I'm a little nervous. Um, but we're going to have to do what we got to do. So, anyways. This is the end of the video, guys. Sorry this video was kind of everywhere. It's very unexpected. Um, thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for supporting my journey so far. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.
Run across my heart and hope to die Your pretty blonde hair, your big blue eyes I wish you knew just how you make me feel No, I've never ever seen anyone so perfect Feel insecure, question if I'm worth it I wonder what the hell you see in me Cause I don't know what you see in me